Today we're reading from John chapter 4 and verse 14. Jesus said, But those who drink the water I give will never be thirsty again. It becomes a fresh bubbling spring within them, giving them eternal life. Throughout the scriptures, what we see is that water represents the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit is essentially God in spirit. And the Bible says that we can be filled with the Spirit and that Jesus baptises us with the Spirit. The word baptism essentially means saturated. So like a sponge, if you get a dry sponge and put it into water and just push it to the bottom and bring it back up, you'll find that you know, it might be a little bit wet on the outside, but it's not really got any water on the inside. Whereas if you push that uh, sponge down into the water and squeeze it a little bit and then let it go whilst it's in the water, then bring it back up out of the water, you'll find that it is saturated with water and water goes everywhere. It's the same with God's spirit. Jesus says that he wants to saturate us in God's spirit. Through the trials and struggles in life, he wants to see us squeezed so that we take on board more of God's ways and more of his spirit. Jesus says that this leads to eternal life. As a pastor, you can really notice a difference between people who are filled with the spirit and people that aren't. They just do faith and life differently. People who have been saturated in the spirit tend to try to be holy. Their actions collide with what we believe. But here's the thing, people that aren't saturated with the Holy Spirit oftentimes don't really make very good Christians. So today, if you're feeling like sometimes you're not a very good Christian, maybe it'll be a good idea for you to ask God to saturate you in his Holy Spirit. So like Jesus said, the spirit, the water that he gives you will well up inside you, will bubble up and will eventually work its way into eternal life. He'll lead you into eternal life. If you need help doing that, let us know. We'll help you through that. See you soon.